Suppose you have the model which is log log, which is in log log form, that is log of the dependent variable and log of the independent variable. And you have the model of this kind. So taking up log of both the sides, what will you get? What will you get is log of yi equals to log of beta 1 plus beta 2 log of xi plus log of e to the power ui. Now log of beta 1 would be a constant so let's say write it as alpha and you have beta 2 log of xi plus you, you should remember this that log of e to the power k is just k okay so it is ui and here it is log of yi so this is the model which you have huh? so this is as you could see here this is a log log model log with the dependent variable and log with the independent variable now when you run this regression okay you will have the values of uh, alpha hat and beta 2 hat okay when you run this regression you're going to have the the values of alpha hat and beta 2 hat and these will be the unbiased estimates of alpha and beta 2 remember this that alpha hat and beta 2 hat would be unbiased estimates unbiased estimates of alpha and beta 2 hat okay now in case if you look at this model and if I want to take up an elasticity what will and, and one more important thing is that uh, that uh, this alpha hat would be an unbiased estimate of alpha definitely but uh, beta 1 hat okay because your alpha is just log of beta 1 beta 1 hat which is an anti log of alpha hat would be the bias estimate okay would be the biased estimate now let us look at our model again which is log of yi equals to alpha plus beta 2 log of xi plus ui suppose you have this model now you want to find out first of all the elasticities which is 1 upon y dy by dx equals to beta 2 into 1 upon x okay this is uh, the, so your dy by dx would be equal to beta 2 y by x now if I want to write the elasticities elasticity my elasticity is dy by dx into x over y which is beta 2 y by x into x over y which is just beta 2 so your beta 2 is basically the the parameter beta 2 in your model the mo the model is this okay in your model here beta 2 is actually telling you the elasticity of uh, of uh, elasticity between y and x and uh, remember this that one more important thing about it is that this elasticity coefficient this is constant throughout this is constant throughout so and because of this reason this model is also called apart from log log model constant elasticity model constant elasticity model and uh, and remember this that this this just one value of beta 2 which is showing you the elasticity which is independent of all x and y's this is one of the major attraction of the log log model okay because it measures the elasticity of y with respect to x so how do you interpret such kind of model so the interpretation of this model is very important so kindly write this out 
that suppose you have this model which is log of y equals to alpha plus beta 2 log of x plus ui then how do you measure this you measure it like this that if x goes up by one percentage on an average y goes up by beta 2 percentage okay now supposedly if you have the model which is log of y equals to 2.15 plus 3.7 log of x you have got this Okay, after running the regression, you have got this. So, what, how do you interpret this model? You interpret this model that is, if x goes up by 1%, then y goes up by 3.7%. This is the way you will, you will interpret this model. 